Stay. Stay. What? The fuck? Oh, she's tripping. Away from her. She's tripping. Away from him. Whoa. Oh. Oh. Is she gonna do the same hits that he did? Oh. Welcome back, YouTube. We are here for another video. We are here for Life is Strange True Colors. We are back. We are back in the realm of Life is Strange. Like you know, for these long-winded, yappage kind of gameplays, we are streaming it live on Twitch. For all my first-time chatters over here who have followed the instructions given and showed up to show out for YouTube, you know, I appreciate each and every one of y'all. Make sure you guys are subscribed and liking the videos commenting something nice because if you say something mean i'm not going to be the one to respond to you i can't promise you who will but i can't promise you they won't reciprocate your energy so let's just be productive in the comment section right okay let's get started okay so alex the day's finally here you've been at the helping hands group home for eight years oh shoot We've group been home through a lot in that time we have. And now you're finally leaving to live with your brother. My brother, Gabe. It says here he lives in Haven Springs, Colorado. Is that correct? That's a big move. Do you have any plans as far as school? Group or home, not the same as foster care, right? My brother said I might pick up a few shifts at the bar he works at. So you'd be dealing with people. Maybe. Does your brother know about your issues? Oh, Lord. What issues? Is that an official interview question, Dr. Lin? Alex, you know that I care about you. With everything that has happened, I just want what's best for you. How old is she? He doesn't know. No one will once I leave this place. I'll just be a normal girl in a normal town. She killing this A-line bot. Okay. True colors. I don't know what to take from that. Group home. She has a brother. She in therapy. It's something she hiding about herself. Side A, a cassette. Where'd she get that kind of bag from? Ain't nowhere I could find one of them old school Gabe army said bags, to meet him bro. At the bridge. I can't wait to see him. That's like a runaway special. Every movie I done seen with a runaway got one of them bags. That's a special kind of duffel. She want to literally smell the flowers. I mean, it's beautiful out here. It definitely is. You know, I will come, you know, a little, little vacay, a little peaceful. This is where I would read a book. Absolutely. Press B to leave the Zen moment. We got wild deer out here. You know, I'm just taking it all in. Okay, flowers, sunflowers. Okay. All right, that's enough. Alex. Holy shit. That's really him. Okay. <laughs> oh. Are they mixed? Oh. What's the protocol for? It looked like he mixed with a little brick. Sister after 8 years. Hug him. You finna live with him. I'm cool with this. This action will are. have consequences? A hug? Who is a 
Smashing my ribs still part of the protocol. <laughs> How we get so a consequence from HUDs? I can't believe you're here. Believe it. Oh. Oh, what's she seeing? She saw growing up. Yuck. I missed it. She reading thoughts? Oh, this is disgusting. I'm a lot taller, huh? Yeah, yeah. Time will do that to you. That's one. Are you ready to uh, see the tale? gift i would not want i do not want to hear people's thoughts bro i'm sure he nervous too i ain't gotta say it hell yeah let's rock and roll Ugh. i don't know why i said that why she gotta Me be neither. so cringy <laughs> but i love the enthusiasm okay the uh, black lantern is just up the street you can't be normal i mentioned i live above a bar right even better how was the trip you must be wiped i'm good the drive through the mountains was amazing. Eleanor, hey, Alex just got here. Alex, meet Eleanor Laith, owner of the flower shop. What's up, Eleanor? And honest to God, royalty of Haven Springs. Oh, it is so nice Look, bro, to finally meet you. I didn't want to hug you. Welcome. Oh. I hugged my brother, bro. I don't know You're you. We're so glad to have you, Alex. Gabe told us all about you. I'm glad to be here. I don't like people that can't feel the awkwardness of me not hugging back. Let go of me. She seems nice. Yeah, she's great. A little quick on the draw with hugs, though. Yeah, no shit. Welcome to Haven. Ain't nothing popping out here. Like Austin. <laughs> it's downtown Round Rock. That's where we at. This is nasty work. It's nice. Come on. Is this the first official stop on the tour? Absolutely. If you follow me inside, you find a prize. It's a <laughs> <P-bill>. <laughs> Gabe Chen buys makeup flowers for an angry girlfriend. Oh, I can't wait. It's gotten so so reviews. <laughs> hey, Gabe. Riley, meet my sister, Alex. Okay, Riley. Is that his girlfriend? What's your greatest weakness? What? Uh, Hello? What? It's for a college interview. We've been debating this one for days. Gabe insists that I give an honest answer. It's always better to give an honest answer. Oh my and God. what's the alternative? You too comfortable. Lying? Not lying, more like strategic half-truthing. Like I work too hard or I save too many puppies. No. I can smell that bullshit a mile away. I've been trying to warn her. Oh yeah? What would you do? I, I, I would have put my headphones on. Be clever, she about to piss me off. I would be clever. Telling the truth only gets you so far. Oh, you hear that, Gabe? You're outnumbered. I'll never surrender. Gabe. He'll come around eventually. Cornball just running the family. Alex, help me out real quick. What do I get for Charlotte? Sunflowers are her favorite, but I read online that Lily of the Valley is great for saying sorry. What did you what do? do? You oh, perfect. Perfect. What uh, exactly are you apologizing for? This time around? Dang. Maybe the toilet seat? <laughs> the toilet seat? Boy, get out of here. Save that for when you cheat. If Charlotte loves sunflowers, go with the sunflowers. You in here flirting That's with Riley. I was thinking. I know what's up. You know, if Mac brought me flowers half as often, well, he wouldn't be Mac. Is it still on and off with you two? Sort of. Get out of her business. On right now, but wait five minutes and ask again. <laughs> Put this on my tab? Yeah. Are you sure you don't want to just tell Mac about the interview? No, not yet. I'll handle it. Okay, your call. We can leave when you're ready. Sounds good. 
Might as well have a look around before okay. we leave. Okay. Here we go looking. Approach the objects. Use all, use all the buttons to interact? Dang. How to kill everything you touch. A flower book by Alex Chen. Bro, I'm not finna read this. No. They always want you to do some extra. Perfect. Okay. That guy's bad to the gnome. Right? I heard bad the to the gnome. Place. Oh God! Please stop. Uh, no problem. Oh my God! It runs in the family. Oh Lord! You can make anything pretty. I you hate it. Okay inside. Oh no! Category for estranged brother you haven't seen in eight years because you were ripped apart by the foster care system. Foster care. That's a shame. So there is some association to it. I'm not reading that gardening book. Does anyone actually sit in the decorative store chair? Hopefully my advice doesn't derail her entire life. I'm sure it's fine. What if I don't get in? Shit, what if I do get in? Am I really ready to leave this place? If Riley's so anxious about leaving this town, I guess it can't be too bad. Oh, this kind of crazy. What if I don't get in? Oh, we, we, uh-uh. Shit. That's enough. What if I do get in? Let's be nosy. Are we really ready to leave this place? This is real nosiness walking to the back of the store. See, if, 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 if there was real ones, they let it, what? Can I talk? They would have let me go back in the um, employee room. Ready. Thanks. See you soon, Rye. Okay. Do we know if he has kids or he just got his main lady at the house? How long have you and Charlotte been dating? They finna tell me. Mm, about three years now, I think. You must spend a lot of money on bouquets. She's worth it. Okay. Is that a dispensary? Watch your feet now. It's getting windy. Let me go up in here. Hold on. Are they growing it out here? It's a wreath. These are really nice. Thanks. I hand wove every wreath myself. Okay. Wow. Well, here we are. What is this? Wow. Good to know. A blasting notice? Warning sirens will sound prior to detonation in areas I'll read this. Let me see. It's the exact same thing I just read. Alex, wait up. Are you, where are we going? Step one, patch things up with Charlotte. And step two, Alex and Charlotte become best friends and everyone's happy forever. Gabe's pretty nervous about making sure I'll like it here. It's sweet. Is it? Who said I wanted to be besties with Charlotte? Gabe Chen, flower delivery man. I know, right? Let me duck in here and smooth everything out. It'll only be a minute. I'll introduce you properly later. Once, you know. It's no problem. Oh, we're going really. in the dispensary. Oh, I like Charlotte already. It's gonna be longer than a minute. Excuse me? Trust me. Oh, hi there. Who are you? Gabe's your brother, right? I'm Ethan. Oh. Charlotte's my mom. Hi, Ethan. I'm Alex. Okay, little Ethan. What you reading? Ninth Warden. Oh, has she found the Scepter of Serenity yet? Look at her She's spoiling it. She's looking for the it. Scepter, but I think she'll need the Bangle of Vanishing to get to it. I wanted to turn invisible so bad when I was a kid. Still do sometimes, to be honest. You can get away with anything if you're invisible. And no one can stop you. Ethan, what do you do outside the dispensary all day? If you like comics, I can show you the one I'm making. Mm, you know? I'd love to see it. What else are we gonna do?
You can keep it if you want. I made a bunch of copies to sell in the record store. Okay. Hey, this no is more. awesome, Ethan. I can't wait to read it. Are you going camping? You know the mines? Oh, I know they shoot. Exist. There are a bunch of old tunnels all around the mountains. I think I found a way into one. I mean, I'm not an expert on old mines, but that would scare the crap out of me. I just like to explore sometimes. It's no big deal. Oh man, I shouldn't have told you that. He thinks you finna snitch. I know we just met, but be careful out there, okay? You don't need to worry, really. Look at me bonding. I Little think Ethan. I'll check out that record store. Nice meeting you, Ethan. Why wouldn't he bring Charlotte out to meet me? I done met her son before her. Come outside. Y'all in there smoking a doobie? Let's go. And what did he do? He just didn't leave no toilet seat up. He's really concerned about saying sorry and patching things up with Charlotte. She's sick of him in that flower store, wow. I'm telling you. Okay. This place reminds me of the shop Gabe and I used to go to. <laughs> He'd save up for weeks from his shitty car wash job just to buy us something to listen to. It's crazy. W memories. Here I am, years later, still waiting for my big brother in the record store. What happened? Except this time, I'm buying the record. I need a family history. We need to like backtrack a little bit. No way. Girl, what are you doing? She's not even paying attention. Yeah, I could have had a gun pointed to your face. What are you finna do? Oh, uh... Oh, it's a whole glass. I would have shot back at myself. Unicorn sandwich? Hit me with that zombie parade. Let me see. Watch it be trash. Citizens of Haven Springs, that was the Wednesday with Bomb Squad. We on the radio? Up we next, live? A very special request from some chick. Oh, you could have asked me my name, bro. Sorry, the store's actually closed right now. Which is confusing because it's obviously open. Wait. It's not bad. Are you Alex? I am. That's me. Who you is? Wow. Gabe's been talking about you coming since forever. Okay. I'm Ryan. Not you waiting for me. Hi, Ryan. Nice to meet you. So, all the way from Portland, huh? What do you think of Haven? Considering I've been here for like a minute, I'd say I'm undecided. Fair enough. I guess I undecided said the other one. is better than running away screaming. It's not like I have a choice. So, I was just in the a group home. closed, Let me but be they grateful. opened it just for you. You must be picking up something pretty important yeah well you could say that an outdoorsman's guide to the calls of common birds look how he's checking her out wow that's oh oh i feel like they both can come off a little disrespectful nerdy might come off a little jokey but that's if, like, you know, she's trying to flirt a little bit with Ryan. Let's, let's keep it cool. Not what I was expecting at all. 
It's a pretty obscure record. Hmm. The National Park Service gave it five stars. <laughs> Look at how so wanted me to flirt. You're a uh... Colorado State Park Ranger. Oh, y'all excited all over there. Into focus. Well, bummer the store's closed. I was thinking of getting a gift for Gabe, but I'll figure something else out. I don't even know if he still listens to records. He does. Charlotte just got him a record player for his birthday. Oh, shoot, Charlotte. I'm pretty sure he put something on hold. She just got him a record player, and here he is, needing to apologize already. So you don't work here? Steph won't mind. It'll be the easiest sale she's ever made. You're about to piss me off. If I could just find the whole list. <laughs> Damn. I know I saw it before. Want to help me look? Excuse me? Oh, yeah. Any ideas on where to start? Look at Ryan. No idea. Steph leaves stuff all over the place. We'll go behind the register. This place has just the right amount of dorkiness. Now I can sprint. Oh, my God. Gabe's record is in here. But which one is it? Perpetual motion. Looks exhausting. Hey. Gabe and I used to dream about cutting demos all the time as kids. Never got that. It's been so long since I've played. Okay, so she played an instrument. She got sheet music there. Is it wrong that the note makes me want to touch it more? All right, that, uh, whatever I'm looking for, Ryan. Why aren't you looking? I could have sworn she set it down over here. You're just watching me look. Don't get me wrong, Steph's great, Ninth but Warden, she can hero be kind of, of a mess. Intergalactic Peace Wars and friend to lonely children everywhere. Search I'm detecting it. an indie pattern. Okay, a seriously obscure indie pattern. Oh. Color me impressed. Where is this boy record at, bro? Cat boy, where the cat at? Valkyrie. That's one badass cat name. Oh, he right here. Valkyrie. Wait, is that the hold list? What is you doing, bro? Move out the way, Don't bro. Don't freak out. I'm just gonna... Oh! Okay, just kidding. He got it. I'm surprised you got out of there with both your hands. Come help Thing me. Is, she's sitting on the hold list. We could use her toy to lure her away. If we can find it. Lure her away? Give me a hand. See? Scare is crazy. Ooh, that cat gonna ha hate me. If I scare that cat... That cat's coming from my behind every time she... I don't know if it's a boy or a girl. Every time that cat see me. Bro, what do I need to help you with from behind? Like what am I doing? Cat toy? Not yet. So, what's the prediction? What do you think Gabe listens to these days? Let's go look at the list. I'm guessing he's gotten pretty deep into the acoustic EDM scene. Isn't that an oxymoron? Yeah, Ryan. Keep up. Oh, deep. <laughs> well, there's only one way to find out. Let's see if we can find that cat toy. Bro, you can't find anything, bro. You search like Brazil. Surprisingly not covered in stickers. Looks like a toy could live here. What if he exclusively listens to Smash Mouth? Wait for it. Cover bands. Ugh. I disown him. <laughs> Damn. Bro, Brazil will walk into a room, literally turn in two directions across the room and say she can't find some. A good place for toy safekeeping. You could check the register. Okay, but what if it's three unbroken hours of improvisational jazz flute? That he listens to while writing scathing film reviews. 
Yeah. And sipping a $50 Americano. <laughs> oh my God. Mm. Alas, no toy. Okay, that's, that's enough. I'm scaring him. F this record store. I, I don't need to come back in here. It won't even let me leave. I gotta ask about everything. Maybe that drawer? It could be Celine Dion's greatest hits. You mean the essential Celine Dion? She is a Canadian treasure. Y'all just in here yapping? Mm, nothing. Maybe in the junk box. That toy better be in there. Huh. And we have a winner. Good guess. <laughs> Watch that cat still not Be move. safe out there. If I die a horrible cat related death, tell Gabe I'm sorry. Throw it. <laughs> Who's the superior mammal now? Oh my gosh. He finna run right back into that clipboard. Right. <laughs> Good idea. Thanks. For a guy who lives in the woods, I'm pretty good at this customer service thing. She got lucky. Gabe, tiny blue bot. Okay. Okay. Kings of Leon, okay. Should've known. Wait, seriously? Gabe and I used to listen to records together all the time. We'd forget about the world and rock out for hours. You gotta tell me what Gabe was like as a kid. Any ammunition you can give me? Okay, okay. Actually, he was a pretty badass older brother. He smoked cigarettes, which at the time I thought was awesome. And he somehow managed to get his first tattoo when he was 12. Damn, the legend only grows. All right, you're looking at 20 even. Okay. That's kind of expensive for, I don't know how much vinyls cost. Let me shut up. No, oh. no way. Oh. I can't believe you're doing this no. again. Come on. Do what you the have red any mean? idea how much time I put into this? She just, starts imitating no, what they're doing? I can't come over there. I'm working. <sighs> oh, that's sick. Now he thinks she's crazy. It's called a job. Maybe you'd understand if you ever had. I can watch the boost if. You're looking at her like the hell. Hey, hold, hold on a sec. Are you serious? You have a playlist, right? I think I can handle that. You're a lifesaver. Oh, no bird calls though. I'll be there. One sec. Why we can't listen in on her thoughts, bro? Organizing a LARP shouldn't be this hard. What's coming out of her? Are you okay? Right, look. Never better. He obviously saw something was wrong with you. Use better Sorry. now. I was just a little thrown for a moment. Thanks. You got it. Look how he feel like he just saved her. Feeling all connected. <sighs> Somehow I knew I'd find you in here. Things went well with Charlotte? He hiding a gift. Thanks to your help. I can't wait for you guys to meet. I think you'll be great friends. Speaking of, my two favorite people in my favorite place. What have you guys been up to? Talking about birds? We was not talking about no birds. He might quiz me. Just looking around. This place is pretty sweet. Every time I'm in here, it reminds me of you. I'm not surprised you like it. Anyway, I'm glad you two met. Not only is this dude my best friend, he's the best guide to Haven you could ever find. And Not this dude, guy. 
hands me the best beers? Do you work at the flower shop or a bartender? Mac was in here earlier, and uh, he really wants to talk to you. He knows where to find me. Anyway, my shift starts in 20. Ready to go? Take along? I'll catch up. I got a radio show to host. Ryan be like... I don't know. He cute and all, but he a little clingy already. Check in. Do you mind? No, yeah, of course. He act like he been knowing me for years. What up, Monster Slayer Thanor? Hey. One week to the LARP, you stoked? Hell yeah. Had a boy. No, we gotta talk road trips next. It's a long drive to Denver. Are we driving with Steph? We'll see. She's a GM, so she's got to be in Denver pretty early. What are you doing tonight? You don't know what a GM means. Mom says I'm supposed to stay at the Lantern until she gets off work. But I kind of want to hang out at home. Is that okay? What's the Lantern? Do you, man. <laughs> but I'm going to check that homework later tonight, though. Better be done, Capiche. Capiche, good to meet you. Okay. Yeah, same. See step, you around. Step Daddy Gay. Step Daddy Gay. It's so weird seeing you do the dad thing. Dad thing? No, 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 no. No, no, I'm better than a dad. I'm like Dad Plus. <laughs> we trust each other. He tells me stuff he doesn't even tell Char. Ethan didn't tell Gabe about going to explore the old mine. He Ooh, trusted that's where he's going. Secret. Oh, should I? Shoot. Or should I oh, blow his cover? Oh, shoot. Oh, my gosh. We're just starting out a relationship with Gabe. See, the problem's going to come in at... If something happens to Gabe and he comes back and he's like... Well, I told, uh, uh, what's her face? And they're gonna look at me like, why you didn't say nothing? I'm gonna be looking like stupid, but my grown behind talking about, I want to snitch on him. I'm telling. Uh... I should probably tell you something. Shoot. Earlier when Ethan and I were talking, he mentioned exploring some old mine. Oh, man. He seemed like he knew what he was doing, but I thought you'd want to know. <laughs> this fucking kid. Oh, he's sick of it. I'm going to tell Charlotte. Just give me a sec. He's sick of it. Ooh, Ethan's in trouble. Really? Look how he's excited about it. Ugh. We'll I appreciate you telling me. You did the right thing. What if you ain't even going to the mine today? What do you say we get you settled in? They just gonna let... They just... They're not gonna ensure he's actually going home? Oh, my God. This is what a mining town looks like. He felt like telling the mama was enough. there's any more guys in overalls running around. He over being With a stepdaddy. all over their faces? Exactly. Do they mine here, though? Used to be silver back in the day. Yeah, mountain and mine? now? Uranium. They blow these big holes in the mountains and sell it off to nuclear power plants. Oh. Yeah. We'll actually be able to hear a blast later tonight. It's pretty intense. Sounds like it. Look who it is. Jed. Hey, got someone I want you to meet. You just introduced Alex, me to the whole town. This is my buddy, Jed. Can I put Bloody my stuff hell. down at the you house? Listen to this horse shit. Oh, his bossy means. You on the Black Lantern. For the last twelve years or so. It's good to meet you, Alex. That's Heard where. Heard a hell of a lot about you. Oh. Only bad stuff. Mostly lies. Ain't the Lantern where? Your brother's full of shit. Charlotte you know told that? Ethan to go. He just about wet himself waiting for you to get here. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, did he manage to hold it in this time? Good for you, Gabe. <laughs> I like her. <laughs> yeah, I like her. Yeah, she's okay, I guess. We're heading in. You coming? Uh, in a minute. Supposed to meet Eleanor to talk spring festival decorations. Did he tell you about the festival yet? Not in detail. I'll fill you in later. Like, you do not want to get this guy started. I'm loquacious, goddammit. It's charming. Okay. Oh, before you leave, word of warning. Max got that old bug up his ass again. So I've heard. Yeah. Jed so, ain't got no ring on his finger. Just, you know, eyes open. Yeah, back Anyway, here. you guys go settle. Alex, pleasure. I'll mind, Jed. So, spring festival equals mountain prom. It's a lot cooler than it sounds. Not possible. I'm picturing some straight up wicker man shit. Yeah, kind of cool. Oh, you've been before. You know? Jed owned the lantern? He the, he, he the boss? You know? <laughs> Please. At this point? Ain't turning it down. <laughs> Woo! Shit, man. It's a cute, cute little apartment. I always wanted to yours? stay in, in, in one of these like lofty so style apartments. Big open area. When you said that you had a nice place, I was picturing small but homey. Well then, welcome to my crib. <laughs> my crib, oh my God. Seriously, this is great. And the best part is, <laughs> it's actually yours. I'm mostly staying at Charlotte's now. It's mine? Right. What exactly do you mean, this is mine? It's this thing where people have places they live. Okay, gay. Yeah. We call them homes. I mean it. I want you to have a fresh start here. You know, I'm having a great start here. I got a man over Can at the you... record store. I... Mom. Thank you. Loft. You got it. Just promise me you don't throw too many keggers at end in surprise fires. Fully furnished? Jed will kill me if that happens again. Sure thing. <laughs> All right, you can leave now, Gabe. Get out of my house. Didn't we already do the whole staring at me thing? Dang, right? It's just... Go find go Charlotte. Like how I imagine you'd be. Yeah? Do I look how you expect it? I don't remember. Did they show us a picture of like what he looked like before? I honestly didn't expect you to have a beard. Oh, they didn't tell you? Ugh, why they put when that scratch Colorado, noise in my ear? You automatically get an amazing beard, a pretentious knowledge of craft beers, and a Subaru. Funny, I didn't get any of those things. Don't worry, I will stop at nothing to get you your very own Colorado welcome kit. <laughs> Good, cause I actually got you something. Oh, Wait. the... What? The record. Give me my Surprise. record. Hey. Wait, is this... This is the album I requested. I know, I'm good. I was gonna get this for you. Well, oh. I got it for you first, so I get the credit. We, 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 is it gonna be muted though? It is, ain't nothing playing. Oh, copyrighted music. Oh no, this is nasty. This was the one thing I didn't want to see. Dance scenes with no music? Ah, uh, nah, nah. I can't get over this. This is so gross. Feels just like old times. This is so nasty. 
Oh no. Stop that. It was just feet shuffling. Oh my God. <laughs> Is he still going? Ugh. Oh, my stomach hurt. My stomach hurt. Go get him. Do some more. <laughs> Do some more. This so nasty. Oh yeah, go get him, bro. Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. Oh my God, this is disgusting. <laughs> Lifetime of practice. <laughs> Y'all, oh my God. Is he still going? What is he doing? What Your the, turn. What that mean? What that mean? What is that? Nah, I gotta see it. Fine. I gotta see it. What that mean? She a samurai? Oh, it's the air guitar. Give me a break. I thought she was finna spin that thing. Okay, this is, I'm, I'm over it. I'm over it. <laughs> Turn up then, get, dang. They finna bust the hardwood. Why my voice go up like that? This is, bro, I hate it. You haven't lost a beat. <laughs> Gabe, quit hollering at me. They sick of it. They sick of it. Who just, who banging out the door like that? Just give me a sec. Yeah. Hello? Hey, Mac. Mac? He finna kill Gabe? Why he looking like Can that? Can I help you? Something's wrong. Uh oh. I read Riley's phone. I know you've been meeting with her behind my back. It's not what you think, Mac. Oh, good. I knew it. Because I thought you were fucking my girlfriend. Dude, I promise you've got it all wrong. Tell me why I, I shouldn't get your ass <sighs> right now. No. No, 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 not here. No, no, not here. I know it. It's not my place, man. You really need to talk to I your know girlfriend. it. I'm talking to you. Oh my God. Oh, is she, dang, he hit that table hard. What, what, what is she finna do? What is she finna do? Stay. Stay. What? The fuck. The fuck. Oh, she's tripping. Away from her. She's tripping. Whoa! Oh! Oh! Is she gonna do the same hits that he did? Oh! Dang! She need to teach Gabe how to fight. He wasn't doing all this. Dang! She, oh! Oh! She couldn't Gabe. turn down. I didn't. It's okay. Gay getting beat all over the place. Whoa. He came in here defending his woman's honor and got beat to smithereens. This fucking psycho. You could both go fuck yourselves. I'm so uh, sorry. Don't worry about it. Uh, Fuck. Oh my goodness. I knew it though. Him and, and Riley just too suspicious. Why he gotta say sorry to Charlotte? Yeah, it's, it's fine. I gotta go stop my shift. Oh my goodness. Great. Look at this first day in town. <clears throat> she couldn't stop. What was that? Why does she be repeating the words of the people that be upset? I'm okay. 
it's one thing that like you black out and can't control your anger. But why you be repeating them? Girl, go to I'm bed. Okay. Just go to sleep. I'm okay. That's the end of your night. You do not need no. Uh, you can't. Oh my goodness. Can we send her back to group home? She needs some more therapy. She ain't done yet. Give her. She she needs some outpatient. I guess I might as well unpack. Because whatever that therapist was talking to her about, she she wasn't telling the truth. Oh, that's cute. I like that. What is she getting no dressed way. for? Girl, put some pajamas Gabe has on. This photo too. Look at our parents. Mom's healthy. Dad's only kind of an asshole. Is Dad a bricker? That he looked like he got a little fro. A let Riley's letter. So Gabe and Riley have been working on her interview, and Mac thought they were sleeping together. This is fucking stupid. Dang, I did too. They a little too friendly. Alex, do I want to know? That's that. That's her, right? You want to know? Guess I kind of gave Gabe the runaround, huh? Alex placed that group home in Portland area, helping hands group home. Try program director. Anita and Eduardo. Hello, Gabe. Eduardo and I. Like the good ones. Can I just read it here? And Warner and I were very happy to hear from you. We are glad to see you are doing so well after all these years. Colorado is very far away. Sadly, it was difficult to keep talking with Alex after she was taken to the system. And we don't know where she lives now. Here is the phone number for the agency. Maybe they can help. Oregon Child Protective Service. What happened? They still ain't told us what happened. Wow. Gabe's been looking for me for a while. W, brother. What else we got in here? A little rice cooker. Broadcasting straight from your local record store. Because how fucking cool is that? At least I held it together in front of. Whoa. Looks like Ryan turned my brother into a model citizen. Look at the besties. It's a cute little place. Holy shit. It looks like Gabe actually read Chapter this. four is the most important. Let's just get it over wine. Oh, shoot. Responsi responsibly parenting your independent child. Girl, Charlotte, you need, you need to be reading it, please. I'm really happy for you, Gabe. Oh, Gabe got the jungle fever. Okay, Gabe. Charlotte made this? Gabe mentioned she was an artist, but I didn't realize he meant, like, professionally. I could never make something so personal. Reading from Mexico? Looks like we've both had people trying to help us. I'm glad Lynn. it made a difference for Gabe. I'm down this way. Okay, I never get tired of hearing how great things are for you. Some days I think, you know how it goes with Alex. Okay, he was looking everywhere for her. I'm about to unpack, huh? Unpack shoe shoe. What does that mean? Is that what that bag is called, or is that something inside the bag? Oh God. That's something Shushu's inside the bag. So okay. On this nice bed. She's gotten me through some hard times, but w -shoo -shoo. I was hoping we were done with that. Unpack comic. Bro, take your clothes out the bag. Oh, that's Ethan's Ethan's. really talented. Makes sense that his mom's an artist. Ain't no way Ethan did this, bro. Ain't no way. The drawing, the writing. This is him going inside that cave. That bag done been everywhere. What letters are those? Can we see? Hey, Alex, are those the letters that? I never heard back from Sydney. Oh. 
I hope she's okay. I looked at this a hole. I hooked up. I hooked up with this a hole a couple times for a place to stay, and now he's harassing me. Also, I'm leaving Burnside. The supervisor, a, a racist, and keeps accusing me of stealing. Okay, this was somebody she was in group home with. At least she cared, more than I can say for most. One blame me if you threw this letter out before even opening it. If you're reading this, thank you for giving me a chance to apologize. I wasn't ready. I wasn't cut out for being a foster parent. The stress, the arguments, the shouting, it was too... Oh, okay. So this was her foster really parent at one time. I those meds had worked. Oh, prize lamb. Chelsea. Was that Xanax? The rare bright spot from my time in the group home. Chelsea. One of her friends. Let me wear your clothes. Even when I don't ask, I don't want to sound like a loser, but you're basically the only good thing in here. Oh, it must suck to like build a family out of friends and then you got to leave them to go live a real life in the real world. You can't even take them with you. crazy how much we've changed what happened to this though I, I understand the foster parent situation it was a lot of chaos in the house but what happened here how did she get the foster here they were with the parents at one point did it have something to do with this crazy uh emotion feeling she'd be doing my journal Time to add my latest meltdown. Oh Lord, we gotta write. I wish I, I could journal. Every time I try, I got like, my thought process be moving too fast. It all started with a knock. I think I felt something off before Gabe even opened the door. Like something was slipping un under the frame something red, something raw, pause that. Then there's Mac and that familiar feeling of dread that always comes when I know I'm losing control. And no matter how hard I fight it, it just keeps coming until my blood it is a running boil. Then the part where my whole body has already made the choice to hurt someone and it's going to happen and no one can make me stop. Mac's anger felt hot and dizzy and also a little bit afraid. Really, it was all about Riley. Okay, so she see red and she experiences rage and then relief. The thought of her with someone else, the thought of her with anyone else, it was under his skin burning. That feeling like hot cords grinding around behind your ribs. It's one of the most exhausting feelings in the world. It's such a relief when it's over. When your ears stop ringing and your heart slows down from hummingbird to lazy jackhammer. I don't sound, you know, like relief, bro. It's such a relief. Too bad it caused Gabe a punch in the mouth. How do you apologize for something like that? These threads that bind us up, they burn and weave. Oh. Inside my ribs, they hurt until you leave. I don't know what she's talking about right now. Okay, Isabel. This has to be somebody from the group home. Yeah, it is. Cause they talk, she's talking about confiscating her guitar in a two week band. You know, no memories. My block, what is this? Some text. Why is Ryan texting me? What did he want? Hey, Alec, who gave you my number? It was really nice meeting you at the record store. Looking forward to talking more later. Look at Ryan shooting his shot. Back up. Hey, Alex and Steph, who's giving out my number like this? Sorry, I had to run out like a crazy person. Excited to meet you for real at the Lantern tonight. I'm going out. Chelsea, I miss you. Don't let anyone push. Oh, this group home friend. 
life has been hard these past few years, but I'm really glad we met, period. Gabe, you were right. Regarding the sunflowers, feel like I'll get used to saying that with you. I won't get used to hearing it. By the way, I invited your neighborhood, you to our neighborhood on my block. Okay. Check it out when you have a sec. Okay, that's what my block is. Ugh, the whole neighborhood giving updates. Good luck in this new chapter of your life. Please know I am here for you if you need me. This caller has been blocked. You will no longer receive messages. Why would she block the doctor? Honey, you're, you, you, you still need assistance. Here's a little something to say. Can I no read it? Fucking way. Let me read it. Welcome home. Can't wait to hear you shred. Aww. W Gabe, W brother. Knew I would be nosy and looking all around the place. Hate that I had to punch him in his mouth. <laughs> Okay. Can you play? Let's go. What are you looking at? Well, Alex, you just went nuts and beat the shit out of somebody in front of your brother. So, how are you feeling right now? Girl, if you don't start strumming. We can't even hear her song. How did they make this copyrighted? Bro, I'm so outdone, bro. Give me a guitar. Oh my God, we just gotta watch her mouth move. She ain't even dancing. I can't even whistle. I never learned. Freestyle to what? A silent freestyle, acapella freestyle is just nasty work, bro. How long she gonna sing? That's just spoken word poetry. Mm. Into my room in a new city. Don't test me cause it won't end pretty. I deck you in your mouth, land you down south. But don't forget, it might get litty. You and your damn surprises, Gabe. Oh, that was about as trash as that scene, bro. I should go downstairs and set things right with Gabe. Okay, we we need some kind of action. Let's go. I'm not playing that game, bro. They want to blast that music in my ear every time I walk past it. No. Brian, just forget it. Stop that. You need to take care of yourself. Got Mac patched up. Let's take a look at you now. Oh, looks pretty nasty right about here. Ugh. This is the worst timing to come downstairs. I would have went back up and came down when they were done with this. So, it hurts when you breathe? Alex, you made it. Look at Charlotte. Charlotte, right? I'm sorry you had to see that fight. What a terrible first impression. Dad, I'm taking Gabe to the station. We need a first aid kit that doesn't predate the discovery of bacteria. It's fine. I don't need to go. Well, Ryan knows what he's doing. Now you just go with him. Dang. Alex, I'll be back soon, okay? Okay. Sorry. Again, no, I'm sorry. my bartender and my backup bartender. Okay, Charlotte, I, you know, I'm gonna need her to pluck her that. legs a little bit more. That's it. It's a falling star? Yeah. She real cute, I'm gonna just, you know. Depends on the day, I guess. So. It's giving beauty supply. What's it doing today? Hmm. <laughs> falling pretty damn hard. Yeah. Did you not hear what I mean, happened? I guess, but it's amazing to be here.
What is this awkward silence? I heard Ethan gave you an issue of his comic. He obviously thinks you're really cool. I know literally nothing about kids, but he seems like one of the good ones. I appreciate that. He's my favorite person. Period, Mom. By the way, thanks for telling us about the mine. Ethan's not allowed up there anymore. Yeah, no problem. Charlotte does look like an American me. doll. You did the right thing. Beef pie special. Watch Beef the pie. <laughs> Jed, you didn't have to. Now, Open that Ryan up. Said you're Let me see dinner. it. No starving artists on my watch. Let me see something. I do have to get going. I'm making some pieces for the spring festival and they have to be done tonight. Sorry, I couldn't talk longer. Oh, that's okay. So glad you're here, Alex. I'm looking forward to getting to know you. Yeah, same. Bye, thanks for supper. Yep. Supper. I'm gonna start calling dinner supper. We don't do that in Cali. It's dinner, bro. So I'm short staffed at the moment. Gabe tells me you've worked at a restaurant before. A couple years experience as a server. Uh, you trying to give me a job? What if, what if, what if Jed is pulling my finger? And then I agree with Gabe's story and he's like, I made that whole thing up to see if you would lie to me. You don't get the job because of that. I can't trust you. But come clean makes me feel as though he did tell him. He's gonna know automatically that uh, this is a whole lie as soon as he puts me on the floor. Why can't, why can't I work? Well, I live here. Let me go with this story. This is best case scenario for me. Maybe not as long as that, but yeah, I've done lots of things. You want to work a shift? See if you might this like it here? This is best job distance. Sure. I live upstairs. All right. I'm, I'm, I'm so a wing it. I'm a wing it. I need checking on. Ducky and Diane over there. Steph over here. Uh, there's a table in the back that needs clearing also. I can clean up. You can give the food orders to me and I'll food handle orders. anyone here at the bar. Damn. All right? You know? Got it. He just really gave me nice a- nice to have you here, Alex. A whole lot of duty, Thanks. sir. Can I just bust tables? Guess I'm a server now. <laughs> Let's see how this goes. Oh, hey. Someone made a course about my life. Finding gratitude in Mr. Chaos. You still want to hit the trails later this week? You kidding? I've been this one's from yesterday. Uh, is that Gabe's couch? Can I do the, the, the job, bro? Who table needed cleaning? Who is that? Oh, it's Matt. Oh, shit. He's scared. I'm scared. He's scared of you. At least he's not freaking out. Man anymore. up! He won't make me lose control. Like, I get it, bro. She beat your behind. What you finna do? What you wanna do, Matt? Holy shit. Can I talk to you real quick? No way is crazy. I just, this man is bruised and bloodied all because of me. I'm gonna let him talk. What do you want? Listen, what happened upstairs was fucked up, right? From both of us. It, mainly you, no, honey. You you did get in somebody else's business and beat us behind. Where are you going with this? Why well, is she got an attitude though? Here. I don't like. I'm... She's pretty heated. At, I don't think it helps to recap all the gory details, you know? You are the gory details, sir. So you're saying you want me to lie to cover your ass? No, no, just like, let me handle it. Sure. Look, she's gonna break up with me otherwise. Oh, oh. We've been together four years. She is the 
best thing that's ever happened to me. So please help me out. What does that mean? I don't know, man. What do you want Shit. me to do? What the fuck is wrong with you? Oh. Oh my God. Look at your face. No, it's okay. Don't even. What were you thinking? Where's Gabe? Where's Gabe? Why are you looking for him? How did you know that he was in an altercation with Gabe? Shit? Right, Matt? Because my boyfriend just got into a fight with him. I swear. This is it. How did you she know? Have a good explanation. Gabe already or... went to her about it? We're done. It's, it's not my fault. I just wanted to talk to the guy. About what? About you. About why you guys are meeting behind my back. Okay. So how did the fight happen? He started it. The bastard sucker punched me. You're lying. You're lying. Look at him looking over okay. at me. Um, not exactly sucker punched, but he definitely started it. Oh God, were you there too? Yeah. See, here is my issue. How did she know that the fight was with Gabe already? Who told her? Because if Gabe told her, she already knows. But what did Gabe say? Because she don't know that I was there. I already saw Gabe in, in, in his mouth, bro. I'm not defending him. I don't know Mac. Yeah, I was there. Max telling you a whole lot of bullshit. I don't know you. My first you know time meeting you, beating up my it brother. It doesn't even surprise me anymore. So what really happened? I beat him up. Riley. Mac barged in, accused Gabe of sleeping with you, sucker punched him, and then kicked him while he was down. Riley, listen. What listen. To face? I did it. I did that. Oh, good. It sounds like he deserved it. Thanks for telling me the truth, Alex. Hmm. That's your whole problem, hey, are you, Mac. Are we okay? You've been lying. Are She's you sick fucking of it. serious? I'm so embarrassed by you right now. But are we still together? What do you think, you fucking idiot? No. Alex Chen? Uh. Assaulting Mac Loudon on your first day here, huh? I'm Jason Pike, the deputy sheriff. I'm gonna have to take you in for questioning. I don't care. Are you saying I'm under arrest? Hello? <laughs> your face. Oh my God. <laughs> See your oh face. My oh my God. Jeez. <laughs> no, I'm only kidding. Nobody's in trouble here. I... <laughs> Gabe and I just like to prank each other. Okay, well, keep that with Gabe. I don't know you. <laughs> I've never been pranked by a cop before. <laughs> you definitely got me. <laughs> Thanks for being a good sport. Can I buy you a drink? Get out of my face. Um, maybe I'm working right now. Well, I'll be at the bar. You want one, you just come by, okay? How do you know how old I am, bro? Look at all this stuff I'm doing and not like doing my job. Black people! And they won't even let me talk to them. That's crazy during Black History Month. Spooked patron? What are you spooked about, sir? It's getting better. Christ, she did that to that guy's face? It's steering clear. Aw. As you should. Why are you making friends? Why is he all red, bro? Not, not yet. I know what you do with red. Damn, was that rank out of line? Did I come on too strong? You did, bold. bro. I'll give you that. That's you over here yapping. Starting over from scratch like this? do things, it's just so... Fucking terrifying is what it is. You're telling me. <laughs> Idiosyncratic. What? Idiosyncratic. What does that mean? 
damn boys. Always fighting. Time to grow up. Should have mm. seen Gabe go at it with Dad. He's come a long way. Let, let me do some work. Can I get you to anything? Miss Chen, here at last to relieve Why our suspense. Why does everybody know me? Hi. I am Reginald McAllister, the third, ducky to friends, former entrepreneur, now retired. Y'all ain't feeling Reginald. And this young woman is Diane. That's hey crazy. There. Nice to meet you. I didn't realize that. Uh, that we all knew Big duck. you were coming. Yes. Gabe is generous with uh, both friendship and information. You're from Portland, right? I moved here from DC six months ago. How are you finding the small town thing? Kind of perfect. Love it here. I didn't really know what to expect, but it's kind of perfect. <laughs> it feels like a home. I know, I know. I really thought I would hate it. Then I saw the mountains, met some people, and now I'm never leaving. Diane is a geologist, recently working as a process manager for Typhon Mining. Dang. I'm glad there's another newbie around here, you too. You in here sniffing 10 yards of her Can behind, Can I get Dougie? you anything? Oh, yeah, we're super hungry. I'd love a pie special with fries. Cheeseburger with mushrooms, and my usual to drink, Jed will know what to do. All right, I'll go put that order in. She Thanks. didn't put, she didn't write none of that down. I would have been screwed as soon as I walked away. Hey, Jed. Yeah. I've got an order from Ducky and Diane. Go ahead. Oh! Did he say cheeseburger or a burger with mushrooms? I know it's with mushrooms. I just don't know if it's a cheeseburger. Ah, oh, I told y'all I would have been screwed and I am. I'm going to say cheeseburger. I'm going to say cheeseburger. One cheeseburger with mushrooms. Cheeseburger with mushrooms and my usual to drink. Jed will know what to do. I mean, what's uh -huh. the worst that, that can happen? What did she order? What did she, I wasn't even paying attention to them yet. Pie with fries. I'm going to trust y'all. One pie special with fries. I'd love a pie special with fries. I'm gonna pay attention now. Ducky asked for his usual? Yep. Yeah, he did. Yeah, he's fond of a particular rye whiskey. I keep a personal bottle for him. Pie with fries? No, that's odd. I don't see it. That pizza pie or slice of pie? Oh, now wait. I bet Ducky took that bottle upstairs last night. Yeah, he and Gabe went on carousing long after closing. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Serves him right if you ask me, but feel free to go upstairs and look for it. I'm sure he'd be grateful. Okay. I'm going to take one oh, more order before I go. Pike was with them and might have some idea. If you still trust him after that prank. Yeah, 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 yeah. So funny. Alex, right? I'm Steph. Hey. Just seeing if you need food or anything. Oh no, I'm good. Thanks though. Okay. Sorry I couldn't hang out at the record store. I've got some time now though, if you want to chat. No ma'am, I gotta work, I'm on the clock. I should get back to work. Okay. I could've asked some more questions. I've done what Jed asked me to do. I should see if he needs anything else. Oh, what's, what's, what's going on with her? Haven is nice. Just wish it felt like home. Hope we both get there soon. Oh. Let me go look for the alcohol. Now, where? All right. Let's see if I can find Ducky's whiskey up here. Where would they have gotten some whiskey, bro? Where the whiskey at? The couch? You want no couch liquor? Ha! <laughs> Mockery Hill, straight rye whiskey. I don't think I've ever had whiskey. I'm gonna be honest. Found this upstairs. Don't put your fingers In on the inside of my glass. Couch? Really? Must have been a night. Many thanks, Alex. My pleasure, Ducky. 
Put in a good Can word. Can I pour your glass? Uh, no, no. Allow me. To Miss uh, Alex Chen. Pike gonna fill away. Most tenacious detective. To Alex. Cheers. Ugh. Oh. Ugh. Ugh. I've done what Jed asked me to do. Oh, in that man's mouth. I should see if he needs anything else. My dad was in the service. Let me check on uh. Back again. Might as well get drunk on the first day. I'm ready to take you up on that drink. All right. Hey, hey, Jed, can we get uh? Thanks. And keep it quick. She's on the clock. <laughs> Two shots back to back. I ain't seen her eat no food. <sighs> you know, your brother's been talking about you getting here for months. I'm starting to get the sense. I even remember exactly the day he found your number. He was telling everybody in this place. Really? Yeah. Pretty heartwarming stuff. Well, I've got to get back to work. Later, Alex. Okay. Let me ask uh, Jed what he needs. Are you finished up with everything you want to do? Ooh, let me check. Actually, not yet. Let me check. Ooh, why he looking like that? Give me a second. Are you done now? Yep. Yeah, I took care of everything you mentioned. Is there anything else you'd like me to do? Nah, the boy should be back soon. Well, speak of the devil. How you feeling? Not great. Not awful. I got Alex covering for you. For real? Yep. My job now. We need to talk. I'll be on the rooftop, okay? Oh my god. What we need to okay. talk about now? I think that's enough for today. You did great work. You'll be a damn fine addition to our team. W lie. You can't keep an injured man waiting. You better go upstairs. Thanks. We'll see you tomorrow. Okay. I have not checked, Time checked to my talk phone. To Gabe. Let me check the phone before I go up there. Okay. You said I can't? No problem. This the rooftop? Right? He was really hating on me that I did a good job. Silent treatment. He's not giving the side. You just got here. Ask him how his jaw is. How's your jaw? Now, this is a silent treatment. The hell are you tell me to come up here for? Yeah. You ain't gonna talk. Did you lose your hearing? I'm talking to you. Look, Gabe, I'm really sorry. I. <laughs> Okay. But you couldn't answer my question. I done had two shots back to back. What? I don't need this beer. I. Do you have a cooler under there? I like to hide beers around the house. Because, well, you never know. You never know what? You just never know. What is this conversation we're having, so, Gabe? Need a manager for your underground cage fighting career? Bro. Gabe, I'm really sorry. How many bones have you broken? Like, on other people? Dude. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to hurt you. Don't apologize. I'm fine. Now that we're talking about it. What happened? 
Guess I never realized. Let's make light of it. I'm not gonna call myself crazy. That I can kick your ass? Yeah, I guess. You know, I never realized what your life must have been like. Mm. On your own. It was fine. He felt like all her life she had to fight. You know, when I pulled you off the Mac and you hit me, I, I was angry. Then I thought about how you took him apart. Like you've done it before. I'm sure she had to fight a lot. But she's not fighting off her own strength. She's fighting through someone else's anger. I'm gonna turn it back on him. Didn't you go to juvie? You're supposed to say it with, with like your chest, bro. Prison? Yeah. That was the hardest time of my life. Let me get some background on this family. Some days of that. I didn't think I'd make it out. But I get the feeling you've been through worse. Quick question to me then. I saved your life. He was pummeling you. I can tell there's something going on with you. Something troubling you. Maybe it's time you open up. Bro, it's the first day. Can I go to sleep for a night? I want to talk to Gabe. But what can I even say right now to explain what happened with Mac? Uh... Oh my goodness. Tell me about your past or tell me about your power. I feel like, I mean, if I tell him about my power, what's he gonna do? Send me back to the group home? If I tell him about my past, that'll like create the bonding experience. But it's like, what's that gonna do for when I lash out again? Cause I'm gonna lash out again. She can't control it. Will he believe her? Oh my goodness. I feel like Gabe is cool enough to believe her though. Somebody gotta know. Who I'ma tell, Ryan? It's the first day. It's the first day. Can I tell him about him tomorrow? Oh my goodness. I don't know about her past. I I want to know about her past for my own nosy, uh, you know. I I can tell about my power later. Growing up in the system was hell. In my first foster home, an older boy followed me into the bathroom, so I pushed him out. He got angry. So did I. Then I broke his nose. Dang. I was 14. In the second home, one of the other kids committed. Oh, wow. And I couldn't eat for a month. She then went through hell and back. After a couple of weeks in the fifth home, I got so depressed that my new parents sent me to a hospital. Dang. I never saw him again. Hospital drop off is crazy. It follows me everywhere. It's the other kids get adopted, leave the system, not me. Damn. They never picked me. What happened? How did they get separated? I'm broken. Do you really believe that? Mmm, today I do. 
Today I do. Socking your own brother in the jaw is one for the record books. I don't even feel it anymore. That's not the point. Look at you. You've got a home, a job, a girlfriend. You've got everything figured out. And I don't. Here I come, socking you. Socking Briggs out. Bruising up the community. Stealing jobs. Oh, he was handing me uh, some cocaine. Don't you pass me drugs? A little bit baggy away from me, bro. I don't need a light. Just take it. What kind of bonding experience this is this? It's the cat. What is this? Oh, shoot. A reminder. The last Looks match. Like a match to me. That was the last matchbook I got when I was still in juvie. Did some pretty unsavory stuff to score it. Oh. Unsavory. Do you still have it? Yeah. I carry it with me everywhere. When I got out, I went through the last few matches real quick. Obviously, but I, I could never bring myself to use the last one. It reminded me how bad life got and how much better I was going to make it. Okay. I can't say, girl, say thank you. I don't know what to say. You're welcome. When I found Haven and Charlotte, I couldn't believe they were real. Everything before was such hell. Now it's different. You can do the same. Start a new life. You made it out of the system, Alex. You survived. It's time to move on. Hmm. I wonder if not that simple is going to lead to the power talk. Or if I should just end it right here. Let's keep going. It's not that simple. I've made so many mistakes. We all have. Survival isn't a neat and tidy process. But it's way better than the alternative. And don't forget. I'm here to help you. That's not going to change. W, brother. She should be loaded right now. So, when were you going to tell me about the guitar? Oh, shit. You found it. You had it a note to, to me in surprised. it. Surprise? <laughs> well, what do you think? I'm right. You was in there jamming. I love it. Thank you so much. Talk about she rusty. We couldn't hear a thing and knew you was killing it. Oh, hey, dude. What's up? Here come Ryan. Hey. Thirsty Ryan. Is Ethan up here? No. Ethan at he the mines. Home. Ethan at he the was, mines. I haven't seen him in a while. Yup. 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 He wanted to see the maybe. explosion firsthand. Fuck, maybe he did. What is it? I think he went up to the mountains. If he actually did, we need to move. Now. Let's go. What if he ain't even there? What if he's sleeping in the bed? Ain't nobody checked there yet. Where is Charlotte at? Why she ain't keeping up with her son?
At this point, he need a cell phone. Ethan? Ethan! Come on, pick up, pick up. Who we calling? Alex. Me? Call Gabe. What I'ma do? Look at him. This ain't no date night. This way. Why he got a backpack on? What that mean? Wow. Been a while since I was up here. It's not time to reminisce. Should I be? I don't know. Freaking out right now? In my experience, freaking out is almost never advisable. Bro, everybody's out here but Charlotte. Any luck? In touch base with the safety team up at the site. We're gonna postpone tonight's blast until we find them. Oh. At least we're not racing the clock. Hey. You good? Charlotte's gotta be losing it right now. Why didn't she come? She's tough. Always has been. Come on. Let's take a look around. This kid. Can you imagine the shit we would have caught from dad if we'd done anything like this? Hey. We're gonna find him. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Hey, thanks again for your help. Could have been a lot worse if you hadn't kept me in the loop. Of course. Okay. I'm gonna go take a look around. Let me know if you spot any sign of Ethan. Sure. W snitching. I can do that. Here, here I am. What was Ethan planning to get into the mine? No trespassing. Will we though? Well, we all getting prosecuted. Probably not as fun to write in as they look. Imagine being trapped down there. Absolutely or, not. Actually, don't. When Alex warned me, I could have stopped this. I'm such a fucking fuck up. Oh. He cares about Ethan so much. We have to find him. Come on, Ryan. Everyone is depending on you. Ryan won't let his fear get in the way. Who is everyone? I'm glad he's here. Who is everyone? And why does he think that we're all depending on him? What happened here? Massive cave in. Ryan, get out of my face. Bunch of trapped miners. All nearly died. Jed led the whole team back to the surface. God. Yeah, that's the day Foreman Jed became local hero Jed. And then Typhon closed up this site, basically bought Jed the Black Lantern. Why aren't we hollering Ethan's name? Huh. Can we speed this up? I knew this is what he was drawing. Same logo. Did Ethan base his comic on this place? Sure did. Nothing obvious. Maybe we should... Oh, I should have looked at the other pictures, huh? Notice anything? Maybe I could, like, see what, what was next. No shit. I'll be damned. The whole story is about Ethan's character breaking into a monster stronghold deep underground. Sounds like the mind of me. Does it show where he went? Not sure. The comic ends with the monster hunter climbing a watchtower, which shows him where to go. Oh, he up there. I seen it. There. The silo. I bet that's the tower. That's where he went. I thought that's when I seen a flashlight. Yeah. Great find, Alex. Gabe, you want to take a crack at unlocking that gate? I'm on it. We should also be able to get to it through the processing building. If we can find a way in. Let's take a look then. The processing building. Okay. Ethan based his comic on this place. Hmm, get that helmet. Maybe I should compare his drawings with other stuff in the area. I think I'm looking for something closer to that big building. Oh my God. Nothing like this in the comic. Thank God. No dice. I need to find something like that dead guy Thanor finds. Hmm, hmm, this one, dead guy. 
So if the zombie is here, then... Okay. Okay. If the wall is an illusion... Climbing up the side? No, what the hell are you Ethan doing? Ethan really followed the path in his comic. Finding him just became a lot more doable. Ryan, can you do something useful? Hell. I think there's like a side door back there. I don't know. I guess there might you be. You don't ever know nothing, Ryan. Okay. <sighs> How did Ethan do that by himself? You figured that out from a comic book. Where's Gabe at? I'm gonna try to get the lights on. You try to figure out where Ethan went. Oh my gosh, where are we at? Why is this bad little boy in here? Ethan must have come through here. How did he get out? He found some stairs. Legalize have it. I got some good news for you. Okay, let me find a staircase. I didn't mean to do that. I mean, it, it seems like a slim chance, but. What? It's a long shot, but there's a couple disconnected wires in the box uh, a red one and a blue one. Wow, am I supposed to know which color wire it is? Uh, don't put it on me. I am not making that choice for you. Have you seen any action movie? Ethan must have gone upstairs. Pretty sure Ethan climbed these stairs. Oh, she's been a light her hand open. There's no way Ethan got around all this moving it by himself. Ethan made the jump from here to the conveyor belt. Oof. I think I'll find another way through. Looks like Ethan climbed the conveyor belt out to the silo. Heads up. Okay. Okay. You figured out the door. Yeah. I figured Turns out everything, out you gotta bro. Open it. Who knew? You don't ever figure out anything. Thanks for nothing, Ryan. I hope Alex is right about this comic thing. We're burning minutes here. We're I burning so minutes. Too. Bro, help then. What are you talking about? We're burning minutes, but you ain't figuring nothing it took out. Me so long. Why wouldn't you, you tell never us? Forget how to break a lock. It's like riding a bike. This the food that's wasting minutes. Where to next, Alex? This ain't a game. It's a child missing. Thanor looks out from the watchtower and spots the secret entrance to the stronghold. If we can just... There. That's where he's heading. You're kidding me, bro. That's There's the no ravine. way. Shit. Let's go. Where's the belt? Whoop him. Oh my gosh. We close? I think so. Ethan. 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 Does anybody know we're out here besides Charlotte? What is that? What's glowing? I bet you it's all kind of mosquitoes out here. Look at this little, oh my God. 
Look how he walked across a log. Alex, I'm scared. Oh, is that a demon in him? Is he possessed? Ethan, I'm coming for you, buddy. Wait, hold on. Look at Ryan want to be the hero so bad. Ethan, you okay? Don't worry, we're gonna get you out of here. You work at a record store. Hang on. What skills do you have in this? Fear is so strong. If I get near it, it's no good. We're too heavy. Shit. Make him walk back over. He don't walk this behind over there. What about me? Alex, uh, are you sure? Hell no, I'm not sure. About to risk my life for a little nigga I met today. Remember how I taught you how to anchor a belay? Awesome. Show me. Jargon. You okay? He a national park ranger? Whoops. No, I'm not okay. Honestly? No. That feeling makes sense. Do me a favor, though. See if you can breathe. See if I can breathe. Ryan, get out of my face. Great. As long as you keep doing that, everything's going to be fine. You a lie. Long as he hold on to that rope back there, everything going to be fine. Alex, can you make eye contact with me? I'm going to tie this rope around your waist. The other end is tied around your brother. He'll use that stump as a fulcrum to feed rope your direction. Follow? What are you going to be doing? Nothing as always? Awesome. You're doing super good. Remember, slow is steady. Steady's fast. Piece they better not make me do this, bro. I'm going to get her killed. Piece of cake. This bet not be the first QTE, bro. Oh my gosh. I would have just start sprinting. Forget everything he just said about slow and Hang steady. On, I'm coming. Oh my God. You got this, Alex. Why is it leaning? Why is it leaning? Go back. You'll get hurt. Boy, hush. I'm not going to get hurt and neither are you. You're wrong. I might be. Doing great, sis. Real close. Just a little further. Hey, Ethan, I'm here to help. Okay. Okay. No. okay. Get away. Get away. What's wrong with you? Shit. It's too much. I have to get him to chill out. Girl, get off that log. <sighs> Ethan, I need you to calm down. Can you breathe for me? I should never have come out here. I was so stupid. Yeah, you, okay. got, you got that hey. right. Hey, focus. Talk to me. You want to tell me how you got out here? I was trying to cross to the other side. The log fell. That's fine. Oh my gosh, you are so okay. hard headed, bro. Let's talk about what comes next. Do you see what I'm doing? Gabe's got us. We're not gonna fall. He's got the other end of the rope. No, I can't move. If I move, you're if not you gonna move, fall, what? buddy. It doesn't matter. Oh, he got He's big Lucy in his head. Any sense. I need him to calm down. He delirious. We can't stay here, Ethan. We have to. It'll see me. If I move, it'll see me. What's gonna see you? You don't understand. Leave him right. here. 
Leave him right where he at. I can't help him. I'm not taking that back with me. Understand what he's afraid of. And the only way to understand is to feel what he's feeling. Oh no. Nah. Oh fuck. I can't believe this is happening. Ain't no way. I can do this. I can do this. She wouldn't have felt a demon. She different. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. Well? What is it? Oh my God. What's happening? It's like I'm seeing the world through his eyes. I thought I could, I thought I could hurt the monster. But it's time to meet. The monster, huh? What? I'm not just feeling what Ethan feels. I'm seeing the world like he sees it. You need to uh, pass your doctor's number o over to Ethan. I brought all this brought stuff. All this stuff. None of it will None save me. I'm Gordon. Would it be afraid? But it's just a story. This is real. See. See, he doing too okay. much. He's not afraid of the fall. He's afraid of monsters. He's afraid. Demon. Of oh! 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 Can't let it see me. Can't let it see me. Okay. You look like Bowser. It can't be real. Oh, but it looks pretty fucking real. How 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 you gonna get him to not believe that's what it is? Hey. What you gonna say? Hey, I see it too, Ethan. The monster, I see it too, and I'm just as scared as you are. But Ethan, we're safe. You know why? It can't see me. Oh, W lie. Bangle of vanishing, just like Ninth Warden. I thought that was just a story. Look at him, getting all excited. Some stories are true like monsters so you're gonna hold my hand all right as long as you're touching me you're safe okay okay let's go let's go quit crisscrossing your lips and get up don't look down okay We'll be done before you know it. I hope they don't expect me to do this. Continue the cutscene. Continue the cutscene. Look at Ryan not doing a thing, not bro. Yet. Ever. Oh god. Oh my okay. god. One step at a time. What is this angle I'm looking at? What's Alex? taking so long? Yeah, I'm still really scared. Hurry up. Me too. Yeah. Me too. But we can do this. One step at a time. Okay. We're already halfway there. Do you think the log will break? Quit talking. Be quiet. Be quiet. I don't know. But if it does, I am going to hold on to you so tight, okay? Okay. He ain't tripping. If she would hurry up, this wouldn't be so nerve. Look at Ryan. What are you doing? Oh my gosh. Get a branch so I could grab it or something. Bro. Oh, 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 they're good, man. Tight grip. We're close now, bro. That's it. Come on, there you go. I got you.
What's been happening to her? She finna pass out? <laughs> Is she cackling? <laughs> oh, she's nuts, bro. <sighs> Who gonna whoop him first? Here, here, here comes the explosion. Y'all about to get y'all. Oh! An avalanche? Ooh! Look at that. He would have been stuck. Gabe! 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 Oh, show! No way that that man just cut the rope like that. What? He took my choice away. He could have ran to the back with Ethan. I was the only one connected to Gabe. He was not connected. Why would he do that? I'm letting you know right now. If that was me, Ryan's not leaving that mountain either. You finna go talk to Gabe about what you did right there and then. Oh my goodness. I'm fighting. I'm committing murder at that point. I'm committing murder. Oh my goodness. That wasn't, I don't know nobody else in this town but him. Why would he take my? That's crazy. That's crazy. I didn't ask you to save my life, Ryan. If I wanted to spend the rest of my seconds trying to save Gabe, that's my choice. I didn't say help. Um, I hate Ryan. I don't know how Ryan is gonna come back from this because I got hatred in my heart for him. I really do. Alex told Gabe about Ethan's plans. Feed the, I don't even care about these stats. Alex told Riley the truth about the fight. 60, okay. Alex told Gabe about growing up in the foster. Okay, I wanna know what happened since Gabe, he died not even knowing about my power. Here I am thinking I had another day. Why is life always too short? Uh, Alex hugged Gabe on the bridge. 95%. Alex advised Riley to show off in her interview. I don't even know what happened in her interview now. Alex put cool. Oh my God, that's so stupid. It didn't even go into that ending, bro. It stops at the bar. Riley broke up with Mac in 67%. Dang. I don't care about Riley and Mac still being together. That's the end of episode one. I'm already pissed. I'm already pissed. I don't know how much more of this level of piss I can take. I know in this next episode, Ryan's gonna try to make it up to me. I'm not here for it. I'm not here for it. This is a nasty town to be in without Gabe. I mean, it's not, but it's like, bro. That's her only family she got left. Ah, uh, I'll see you on the next episode. Bye, YouTube. <laughs>